Let's say you want to farm the Banished Knight armor, which is available in Castle Soul. Well, this is pretty difficult, except that there is a method suggested here on Fextra Life, which I've improved on, as you can see here. Uh, it's available to any level character as long as you can make it to Castle Soul, as long as you can cast the Rejection Incantation. I'm showing you around my rune level 10. I'm organizing my inventory so that only throwing knives and Crimson Flasks are on my hotbar. Uh, you'll want to go up the slider as quickly as possible. And then this is very important. You need to knock this particular crossbow archer uh, off the railing here. And you have to check to make sure it goes off or else you have to do it again like so. Uh, and this is important because as you jump onto this rift here, as you can see, uh, if you do not get rid of that uh, crossbow soldier he will shoot you in the back as you go up there the second one which I knock off uh, isn't necessary to do so I just like to do that all right this is a very important point here you have to uh, lock on and give it a little bit of room here uh, between you and the edge so that it has somewhere to go as he starts to disappear charge up the rejection incantation then turn around immediately and spam it and it usually takes about two tries like this, and it will knock him off. It is a fall of lethal height, and you can check to make sure whether or not he's dropped something. He has dropped one here. Uh, we can jump down to the wall, which is now empty, and then jump down again. And this is a fall of non-lethal, non-damaging height. Yeah, praise be Miyazaki. Uh, unfortunately, on this character file, I had forgotten to clear out the courtyard. So there will also be a guide on how to do so uh, very easily on a character that... Uh, isn't leveled up. Uh, the One of the easiest ways to do this is to use the Night Maiden's Mist, which you can get from the Gary Quest line. Uh, the first one can be killed by spamming it from this platform up here, uh, but as you can see, you cannot do the same to the other one due to its aggro pattern or range or whatever you want to call it. Uh, so instead of killing it from above, you'll have to do it from outside the castle. Uh, I've cut to the point where it's the last cycle, but you just have to repeat this process uh, in order to kill it. Uh, go inside the gate and cast the mist right there on the ground. Uh, here I make the mistake of turning around and casting it where I walk through. You don't want to do that, but uh, as he moves up and does this frost breath, he will take damage and die. 